Hey guys, welcome back to Sleeping Dogs. I think we had a really good episode on the last episode. We went undercover to take down this so-called pop star. We didn't do as many main missions as I thought we were going to do, but I feel like it was kind of part of the main mission because in order to unlock more main missions, the green ones, you had to do those like undercover cop files. And so we did them. And then also after that, we met this girl by the name of Amanda. Uh, we were you know, kind of like touring her around in my motorcycle, looking all gangster and stuff. And uh, she gave us her number. So I think we have a girlfriend probably coming up in the near future. I don't know. But uh, the game is amazing. One thing I did notice was that a lot of you are telling me that I don't know how to drive in this game. You're complimenting my Mafia 2 driving skills, but not my sleeping dog driving skills. Mm. I am taking this playthrough as a joke in the sense of like, I'm just really trying to have fun with it because... The driving here is completely different than Mafia. It's just chaotic. It's crazy. So I'm just doing all sorts of shenanigans. All right. So like right now, I'm going to get in this moped or scooter. Actually, it's a scooter. And we're just going to... It's going to... Fuck shut up. Like, that's just what you do here. You know? <laughs> I'm going to try and drive a little better here. Okay. I'm sorry. But welcome back to another episode of Sleeping Dogs. Thank you for all the love and support. Seriously, I, I am really having a Get blast with this now. game. What's going on, Winston? It's Benny, manager of Club Bam Bam, old friend of mine. Now he's working for Dog Eyes. That harm Garton is getting back at us for taking his minibus route. Look, I'll go talk to Benny, make him see reason. Yeah. Yeah, wait, you go do that. <laughs> Yo, relax. Relax, goddammit, poor fish. Um, but yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying my best to really do daily sleeping dog episodes here um, The support on the last two episodes the likes the comments have been fantastic and that's why I'm doing it and GTA San Andreas It did really well the second one as well um, I just think I'm gonna download it on the ps4 and catch up to where I am on the PC version and continue from there Because the PC version is just giving me too many issues So again, if you guys want these two series to continue daily all you guys have to do is just support them and uh, we shall, all right? So anyways, back to my good driving skills and sleeping dogs. Here we go. We're gonna be a good citizen of Hong Kong and we're gonna drive extremely well until I get tired of driving well. And then, you know, it'll be a different story. Talk to the bouncer to get inside the club. All right, yo, what up? Persuade. Are you gonna let me in? What do you think you're doing? I got a message from Dog Eyes. You want to tell him you sent me away? Dog Eyes? Oh, sorry, of course. Come on in, sir. I don't know if this is a proper way to go inside a club, you know? This is, uh... Yeah. It looks like I just got back from the gym or some shit. I don't know, but uh, go inside Club Bam Bam. Oh, shit. Are we in the... Is this like a regular club or is this a strip club? Benny is in the, is, uh, in the VIP area. Make an example. Yo, what are you guys doing here, bro? You have everybody here kissing and stuff. You guys are hot. Hot and like caliente. Like these guys are always horny and stuff. I don't know. They're always making out in the middle of everywhere. And you know, this game just in general. It's not a good role model for kids. Hey buddy, VIPs only. Hey buddy, I will shut your mouth. What's going on in there? This is one of the best karaoke rooms in the city. Nobody gets in without a hostess or the boss's approval. I'm sure we can work something out. Work something out with the hostess. All right, so talk to the hostess about getting into the VIP area. Oh, who's the hostess? Whoa, damn. Damn, girl. Damn, girl. Hey, what's your name? I'm Tiffany. <laughs> nice to meet you. Please. I'm Wei. Wei Shen. You're a karaoke hostess, right? Can you get me into the VIP room? Sure. Just come with me. Okay. Please, guys, do not go to the club and just go up to a girl and say, you have "Hey," a bit of an accent. like Are you that. From like here? that is yeah, just awkward. Recently, but you know, I was in the states for a long time. Oh, that's so cool! I always wanted to go. So, uh, what's Benny like? Benny? You mean the manager? Yeah. Well, Benny's nice enough. He always makes sure you get paid on time. Oh, that's good. So, uh, who does he rely on for protection? Let's go sing. Bro, we just literally pulled this chick like it's nothing. <laughs> Got my hand wrapped around her on a tank top full of freaking tats. Bro, what is this? 
This is actually quite hilarious. I'm sorry. I feel like we're going to probably sing karaoke. <laughs> and there are going to be songs where I might get a strike. So if that's the case, I might mute this part. Just so you guys know. Sing karaoke for Tiffany. All right, let's see. What do we got here? Sing karaoke. The Clash. Uh, be the first to try this song. Hmm. Choose a song. I don't know if these are, are copyright strike. That's the thing. I might have to mute this, this just so you guys know. Okay, here we go. Oh my god. <laughs> what am I supposed to do here? Oh. Um, um. Okay, down. <laughs> okay, I got the hang of it. I know what I gotta do. I just gotta press up on the joystick. Down or just let it rest. Oh shit. Oh my lord. <laughs> this reminds me a lot of Grand Theft Auto in a really weird way. I know there's another game that we played that we sung or we sang karaoke or something like that. I don't remember what it was, but <laughs> it's so stupid. Oh my god. All right, I know this is going to be a copyright strike, so. Okay, so far we're on beat, kind of, sort of. I go down here. The shit you got to do to be part of a freaking gang. Come to a club, dressed inappropriately, and start singing karaoke. I've got a 92%, which is not that bad. Wow, you're actually really good. You like Listen, it? You know, I like it down here, but back home, I'm used to a little more. You'd be the person I'd talk to about that, right? Can I get a VIP room? Yes, of course. It's much nicer up there. Go ahead to the lounge upstairs. I'll get the room set up. Anger. All right, so we're going to head upstairs. Apparently, according to Sleeping Dogs, if you can sing karaoke, you can definitely... Uh, you can definitely go to the VIP section. So, you heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. Make sure you know how to sing. Bye, way. Bye, Tiff. I'll catch you later. Let's see what do we got here? Ooh, we got one of these. Ooh, it's another one of those statues. Yeah, this is the VIP section up here. Oh, hey. hey. Who the fuck are you? I'm looking for Benny. Hey, Benny. Yeah. Some guy here wants to talk to you. Hey, hey, what can I do for you? I have a message from an old friend, Winston Chu. What, 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 Winston? Well, that, uh, this isn't such a good idea. I think you should leave. He wants you to know that Dog Eyes isn't your problem anymore. If he gives you any trouble, you let Winston know, and I'll take care of it, personally. You heard that, man. Get the fuck out of here. Oh man, territorial dominance. All right. Well. Oh shit. Ah oh, shit. All right, this guy's causing a little bit of issues here. I have to beat him up. Mm. Oh. Yes, sir. Oh shit. Come here. Come here, come here. <laughs> Gonna drag your ass downstairs. Thank you very much. You want some of this too? Huh? <laughs> oh, he dodged it. Nice one. Gotta give you props there, bro. Alright. Press triangle to re uh, regenerate my health real quick. How was it that you lock on to the enemy? I think it was L2. And then to... Uh... Oh, there it was. It was R2. That's what I was trying to figure out. How to attack one person and then be able to stay locked onto them while attacking another person. It was like... Okay, it was R2. I was pressing L2 instead. Come here, man. Come 
Come here, punk. Got him. Benny, the fighting in this game is one of the best Benny, parts. I know you're in there. Oh, shit. Why is he running away? I mean, it's not like we're trying to hit him. We're trying to, we're trying to help him out. We're trying to let him know. Ooh. Oh, shit. My dude, please, for the love of God, do you not see I am a karate master? Here you go. Yeah, sure, my ass. All right, that's it. Enough is enough. Okay, where did this guy go? He's still freaking breathing. And we bend his back up downstairs. Okay, can we just drop down? <laughs> Sorry, I kind of stumbled on the rail. We got his back up right here. God damn it! Oh, this guy's got a knife. We gotta be careful with him. Oh no. Oh my god. We got a knife. Pick up the knife. Pick up the knife. Dude, where's the freaking knife? I need to pick up the knife. Oh, there's too much, bro. Way too many people around me right now. God fucking damn it. Pick up the knife. There we go. Cut you up, bro. Cut you up, bro. My health is actually really low. Fucking A. Hold on. This is probably the hardest encounter we've had yet. Okay, I'm gonna grab you. And I'm gonna slam you against this. <laughs> the speaker. Oh shit, wait, I can go to the bar? There we go. Finally, look for any in the bathroom. Of course, out of all the places you want to hide, you're going to hide in the bathroom. All right, sure. Why not? Oh, there's some more tags here. Avoid grappling. Use heavy strikes on them. Right. Here, Benny. I'm going to show you a real ass whooping. I'm going to kick your guy's ass. <clears throat> right as you're sitting on that little pretty little toilet, you little shit. What's up with the sweep? Wasn't there a sweep? Oh shit. Hold on. This is the first. God damn, I just snapped his damn neck. And here we go. I think avoiding grappling is a challenge, so I don't want to do it. Alright, I think we're good. Hold on, this guy's still breathing. I'm gonna make sure he's not. There we go. Although I think that was a grapple. Yeah. <laughs> Relax, Benny. I'm not gonna kill you. Okay. Just listen. Okay. What do you want? Just what I said. Winston wants to be your friend. And what exactly, about dog eyes? Not your problem. I hope you're right. For my sake. Can I go now? Of course you can, Benny. <laughs> That's literally what we came here to tell him. Yo, we got your back. And he's like running away like, bro, forget about dog eyes, okay? We got this. All right, Club Bam Bam. It's actually pretty fun. So I think we also got new clothes. Not from this mission, but from the last one. So I might have to check that out later. Okay. What is this? Surprise exchange. Lock on and press to roll over an enemy and face their back. I'll do that one later. I'm gonna go for this one. I, I gotta return to statues in order to unlock these things or You're late. Conroy's still watching me. He's got a real hard on. 
Is your cover compromised? Well, you haven't fished me out of the harbor yet. All right. How are you doing? How am I doing? <laughs> Fuck, Raymond, where do I start? There's a civil war brewing in the sun on Yi. Winston and Dog Eyes escalated practically every day. Don't you read my fucking reports? I mean, you personally. How are you doing? <laughs> Look, Raymond, I gotta get back. Your state of mind is important, Wayne. It's important to me, it's important to how you do your job. Fuck you. I do my job just fine. Well, that's for me to decide. You mean Pendrew. Pendrew assigned me as your controller. And listen, Wei, Pendrew may not be concerned about you, but I am. I know you have a personal stake here, but this cannot be a vendetta. We're cops. There are rules. <laughs> you're a cop. I'm an undercover cop. The rules are different. And you're fucking concerned about me? You are an officer of the law, Wei, same as me. We are not the same. You understand? We done? Yeah, we're done. I don't know if you guys have heard, uh, seen the movie Eat Man. Eat Man. Um, which is supposed to be like the, uh, you know, the trainer of Bruce Lee. There's like four movies. The last one just came out. I finished watching, uh, part four and I've seen all of them, which great movie, by the way. Uh, but that actor, the protagonist of that movie is supposedly there's rumors saying that he's going to play this guy in like a video game movie. I think that would be a great idea. I don't know if you guys even know what the hell I'm talking about, but yeah, that'd be awesome. Um, come to the restaurant right now, Winston. Okay. me. Return to J. Uh, return the Jade statue. We can do that later. So I guess returning the statues actually does unlock things for you. I mean, that's what we got to do in the attributes department. Get out the way. Um, I think though we are gonna go to. You know we're right here. Let's meet Winston. I don't even think I gotta take my bike. You're literally right around the corner. I love how we got an apartment right next to the restaurant. <laughs> Actually, pretty awesome. Can I help you? Oh, freaking crap! There's a cop right there. Sorry. Oh, freaking hell, dude! Come on. All right, hold on, guys. I'm gonna have to. Yep. I'm gonna have to go real quick. Lose the cops. I gotta lose the popo. This is what happens when you um, when you try to be crazy. All right, now I've got a lot of cops. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh my god. Here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna go all the way back. I don't know if I'll be able to lose them here. But I do want to do that. It's the best way to lose them. Go. I know I said I was gonna drive good, but listen, this is a different matter. Okay? And you bump into those things and you get money as you can see, so I'm sorry. There we go. There we go. Come on. One more. Good. <laughs> Fuck, there's more cops coming now. All right, meet Winston. I think we're good though, right? Yeah, we're good. Holy cow, that was close. Oh my God. That was extremely close. All right, bust a U-turn right here. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't be kicking around uh, all the time, you know? Probably shouldn't be kicking people in the face just walking on by. I don't think that's such a great idea anymore. Do this. Thanks, man. It's fucking great when you're on my side. <laughs> Wait, we've been waiting for you. You guys smell something? I get it. Get your sexy glow shoe. You know what happens to rats, Way? Uh, yeah, I, I heard. Conroy gave me all the details when he was helping me out on that minute. Uh, 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 you so Santa! Who the fuck do you think you are, huh? You come in out of nowhere and suddenly our guys start to get arrested? He ran it out pop star, Winston. I know he did! Oh, you're gonna do it uh, This motherfucker right here is a snitch! Uh, is that right, Mink? You fucking rat. I sent you to pop star, but now he's in jail! Yeah? And who stands to gain the most from that? You're gonna take over Popstar's whole ketamine racket now. No more scraps for you. 
You supply the whole city with drugs. You and Dog Eyes. Popstar's gone, but you're still dealing, aren't you? So who's supplying you? Oh. Are you guys actually listening to this asshole? He's a rat. He's a fucking rat. Take him to Hong Kong, young and stop. You're still working for that bastard, aren't you, man? Wait, 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 swear. Oh, dirty fucking man. Oh, holy shit. Oh my god. Clean that up. Loyalty is important, way. Never forget that. You get in this business for yourself, you're bound to end up like little Lanta. Lanta means piece of shit. Lanta. I just learned a brand new word. Lanta. Whatever. That was cool. My boy got shot in the dome. We almost got shot though. Okay, well they're onto something, for sure. I feel like we're we're gonna end up. Oh man, here it goes. I feel like we're gonna end up uh, in some real deep shit eventually. Honestly. All right, so let's go to Pink's PC, get the package, then go to Golden Koi. All right, let's see where this is at. See if it's on the way. Because if it's on the way, it is on the way. So we're going to go over here first, and we're going to de deliver those statues first. Again? To Yeah, we're going to deliver the Jade statues. Possible murder in the rare and the race scene. Let's talk. All right, we'll talk about that later. Right now, I ain't got no time for this. I'm going to get my motorcycle real quick. Go. Here you go. That's right. Oh yeah. I love how the garage is just there. You just pick up your motorcycle and dip. Let's go. Alright. Let's deliver these jade statues. Oh shoot. <laughs> Bro, this is hilarious. Oh, hold on. leave the bike right there don't go anywhere okay i'll be right back ah oh, the dragon wonderful i must confess i was surprised to see you back i had hoped that you might have escaped hong kong escaped its influences its problems we took them with us when we left so coming back didn't change much are you ready to confront them now yes i think so I have no idea what happens when you do this. I think you just learn the moves, or what do you got to do a mission? What would you like to learn? Oh, I see. The sweep kick. I already learned that, though, right? Um, your charge and he stuns opponents. Strike after tackling. I'm gonna go for this. It feels a little bit easier. Bum bum bum. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Oh, they're stunned. Oh. Nice. Okay, so I guess that's what it does. Have you learned nothing? Oh wow, it stuns multiple? Have you hit him? Nice. I like that. I thought I had two statues though. Because I know he had one himself. And then I think we found two on the last episode. All right, whatever. Anyhow, we got a new move. And now we're headed off to uh, the main mission. Oh, shit. Sorry, it's all about the safe driving. I have promised you guys something at the beginning of the video, and I've already failed you, and I'm sorry. Driving in this game is a lot crazier than in Mafia, though. Like, I mean, look at this. Who the hell does this? All right. <laughs> Holy crap, that was awesome. 
Can I help you with something? Yeah. Are you Ping? <laughs> no. There's no Ping. <laughs> How about the owner, then? I'm the owner. Which is not Ping. <laughs> All right. Not Ping. I'm picking up hardware for Orange Lotus. You know it? Orange Lotus? Sure. This is some pretty sophisticated stuff. Sure you can handle it? I'll manage. My number's on the package. You need a hand getting slot X into socket Y? Give me a call. What? Man, only if life was that easy, huh? But believe me, boys, it's not, all right? I got it. Oh. Come on, dude. Catch the thief and recover the, bu the bug. Come on, way clumsy. Come on, dude, what the heck is that? I wish we had like throwing rocks or knives or something. We could just throw it at these guys that are always, <laughs> always trying to escape us. Would you like some ice cream? No, are you crazy? Why would I want ice cream right now? Do you not see I'm chasing someone? Ooh, into the basketball courts we go. Darn it. I hope this is not like a setup. I'm gonna use my new move on him. Okay, apparently this thief knows how to fight. I'll just grab him, slam him up, pick his ass up, and uh, okay, grapple him. Can we slam him against a card? No? Okay. <laughs> pick him up. Oh shit. There we go. He did. Alright, pick up the bug bag. <clears throat> Call Raymond. Dude, we're gonna get caught eventually, I know for sure. Did you get the bug? I got it. Our surveillance team reports that you should be able to get onto the roof from the construction site next door. Whatever you do, don't let them see you planting that bug. No shit. All right, go to the restaurant. Oh my god, this is not good. All right, I'm gonna steal one of these cars. Actually, you know what? I'll take this bike. Sorry, my boy. Don't take it personal. All right, cool. Oh wait, we gotta go through here. Oops, sorry. Ah uh, shit. Excuse me, boys. Oh, this bike is fast. Why does this feel faster than mine? Oh. <laughs> I just, <laughs> Dude, I just jumped my bike over her face. Holy crap. Savage. Okay, we're here. Go to the construction site across the Golden Koi. Oh, what? I did not know you could do that. Climb the construction to access the Golden Koi. Is this construction really made out of bamboo sticks? Holy crap. Do they really do that? I mean, I know bamboo sticks are hard as shit, but... Sheesh. Okay, hold up. Look through here. Dude, this game is awesome. They need to make a Sleeping Dogs 2 for next gen. It'll be super killer. Let the bus thing go. Good. Well, you can fight, huh? Yeah. Hmm. What? Nothing. Hey, don't try that shit. You got something to say, talk. I don't... That won't go on. It's too easy. This guy comes out of nowhere just when dog guy is pressing us. Oh, bus man. I knew it. Yeah, but where he's been. Ah. Hmm. On the bug inside. Bro, this is ah, oh, this is not good, bro. Hey, I'm getting some noodles from the kitchen. You want some? Sure. Why not? What kind? They're fucking noodles, Vincent. Whatever's back there. <laughs> I kind of feel like pork. So get pork. You want you want pork too? Oh my god. Yo, this is crazy. 
Okay. This is sick, dude. Dude, this is super intense. Let's go. All right, pick the lock in the back door. No way. Oh my God, this is amazing. And look, there's another freaking statue. <laughs> Let's see. Lock picking like mafia. This is the third game we do this in. Oh, that's dope. Oh man, that's so messed up. I kind of feel bad for these guys. I mean, they're all gangsters and criminals and shit, so whatever. But like, you know, damn. Part of me kind of feels bad, you know. Turn to the game. Wei Shen revised. All right. So now what? Now what do we do? Okay. New case available. Hmm. Return the Jade statue. We could probably do that. We could return the Jade statue or... You know what? I think we might actually have to do... Yep. New case is available. We're going to have to do that because that's part of the story as well. That's the only thing that we can do to um to unlock new main missions. All right, let's go ahead and take a taxi there, or not? Never mind. Sheesh. Oh, there's a taxi right here. Yo, taxi! I'm gonna need a ride. All right, cool. Let's go to the destination, which is right here. That was really cool. That sneaking mission where we had to like bug the uh, the restaurant. That was cool. That's going to bite us in the butt eventually. I know it for sure. But um, whatever. <clears throat> At the end of the day, we are a cop. And it is what it is. That's right, the only mission, right? Jade statue, quick fix, a quiet drive, and a new case available. There we go. Inspector. Away. I'm glad you're here. What do you know about the underground racing circuit? Well, they drive fast, occasionally they crash into something. Yeah, and occasionally they end up killing each other. Hmm. Well, that's manslaughter at best. But these last couple of files don't feel like manslaughter to me. It's got more of a deliberate feel to it. You want me to check it out? Yeah. Get into the circuit and see what you can find out. All right. See you. <sighs> Text Jackie about the racing. Jackie, who should I call about racing? Hmm. Damn, man, this guy's fucked up. Ace, he's a friend of a friend. Big race head. I'll let him know your call. Call Ace. Okay. Alright. Here yeah, we go. I'm Wei. Wei Shen. You up for a race? Yeah, sure. Long as you don't mind losing. All right, well, this is for you guys that uh, said that I wasn't good at driving in this game. I'm going to shut you up right now. Here we go. Buckle up, pull up, boys. It's going to be a bumpy ride. Oh, this is a really nice car. Oh, what is that? What the heck was that? Damn, okay, okay. This game has it all. It really does. Like, it, it, it really does have it all. You know, the only thing it feels a little weird because of Hong Kong because we don't live there, so lifestyle is a little bit different, but it's essentially a Grand Theft Auto. It's a little bit crazier, a little bit more cracked out. Anyways, here we go. Oh. <laughs> 
I'm so sorry. I don't even know where I gotta go, to be honest. I guess just follow the, uh... Uh, excuse me. Yeah, you lost the race already. So did you. The vehicle driving in this game is really uh, surprisingly good. There we go. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, my God. I gotta beat this guy, man. Get, get out of the way. Oh, you saw what he did. He did the same thing I did. What an ass. Oh my goodness. Okay, we are 44% complete. Fourth place out of six. This is embarrassing. Why are these cars faster than I am? This is not fair. Yeah, that's right, baby. Look at those skills right there. Look at those skills right there. You guys talking about I don't know how to drive police sorry bucko ah oh, shit how the hell is he gonna pass me like that that is borderline disrespectful this is one of those races where the game just purposely makes you lose isn't it Get off of me. 86% complete. <laughs> Sorry, boys. I got to race you dirty. There's just no way you're beating me. And that's all she wrote. I'm Wei Chang. I will kick your ass in fighting and in racing. Those Amaz kept getting in the way. One in a million shot. You want a rematch? Yeah, sure. I'll take you. <laughs> <laughs> when you're ready for the big time, let me know. Everybody knows I'm the best driver in the city. Everyone. Oh, yeah? I'll take you down too, Hotshot. Just as soon as my car is fixed. Do we get to keep the car? I feel that'd be pretty cool. What if we steal their cars? Wouldn't that be hilarious? I actually like this car, though. Not even gonna lie. Yeah, what now? Cop experience level two. Got a little bit more. Very nice. Almost level three. All right. Now this is hot shot. All right, races for class B are now available. Hey, Way, I need your help, Tiffany. Here we go. Back at the club. Okay? No, I'm in big trouble. I really need your help, please. What's wrong? It's... It's this... A gun? Yes. Charlie made me carry it in my purse for him. He didn't want the cops to find it, so he made me take it. And now he's gone, and oh, I don't know what to do with it. Oh, this is gonna be the first time we... Charlie, he's one of Dog Eye's people, right? Yes, and you took over, right? So in a way, the gun is yours, too. You'll take it, won't you? Oh, that's sick. Sure, I'll take it. That's it? That's, uh, that's your big problem. Yes. Thank you so much, Wei. I knew I was right to trust you. Don't worry, Tiffany. I'll take care of it. Thanks, Wei. You're the greatest. I, I don't get it, bro. Like, <laughs> man's a cheek magnet, bro. I'm starting to get jealous. Paul Raymond. Hello? Raymond, I got something. What is it? Something for ballistics. A weapon belonging to one of Dog Eye's men. Do you know Charlie Pang? Wait, how did you get Charlie Pang's gun? Never mind. Can you use it? All right, meet me. I'm on my way. You're aiming at the North Point underpass. Ah, oh, there's some slimy ass business going on here, man. You guys are so right. This game is so freaking good. This game really is good, man. It really, really is. Like, it really is starting to get really, really good. The beginning, of, like the first 30 minutes, it's okay. It's like, oh, this game is pretty cool. But after that, we 
when you start seeing the possibilities of all the things that you can do in this game, it's actually pretty insane. Andrew? What are you doing here? Where's Raymond? This is something I wanted to handle personally, Wayne. <clears throat> Do you have Charlie Pang's gun? Yeah. I'm sure you've noticed that guns are something of a rarity in Hong Kong. Not like in the States. This particular gun is quite important. So who's the dead guy? I was hoping you'd help me with that, actually. What the hell? Officer Shen, take up a firing position. Okay, you ready? Fire warm-up shots into the debris. Okay, so suddenly it's daytime. All right, listen. It's simple. We'll have to recreate the fight. Hang on. Let's just talk about this. Fuck you. Let's go. Damn it. <laughs> Yo. First he was in cover behind the barricade. Get down behind that barrier. Good. I want you to put some bullets in a few things. Okay. So TV. I don't know why, but I didn't think about this. Like I, I didn't think about the fact that we were not using guns. Okay, shooting without. All right, good. By now, <coughs> the van must have appeared on the scene. Oh, shit, let's go. <laughs> then he must have run through over there. Shooting at the guys over there. Oh, they're shooting. There was a shooter. Firing shots from the passenger window. <laughs> oh, I don't know you could do that. Oh, okay. Jesus. God damn. One more thing. He would have tried to get away, but Charlie disabled the car. Your weapon, officer. Good firing way. Pendrew! What are you doing? I told you he wasn't important. Now he is. He's going to help us nail Charlie Pang. It's for the greater good, Way. You understand? I don't think I do, sir. Way, I know who you are. You're just like me. You do what must be done. I think we're going to betray him, mm -hmm. ultimately. Local PD is on their way. You should go. I have a feeling this is going to be kind of like Fast and the Furious. Where Brian O'Connor is, you know, he starts off as like an undercover cop. This might have been, honestly, just... This game probably could have been... I don't know. Kind of a motivation behind this game could have been that. We start off as an undercover cop. And then we... We end up just siding with the criminals. And now we got to lose the cops. Oh, God. Hold on. Just when I was gonna do my damn outro. Sheesh, man. Okay, I'm gonna have to lose the cops here, though. Alright, let's lose the cops. Down through here. We'll be good. Excellent. Excellent. Alright, so we just found out about the Mrs. True's restaurant got hit. Oh shit. We received a tip on Hotshot's whereabouts. I parked the truck nearby so you can bug his car and tail him. Oh really? Okay, so that's what we're gonna do next. Um, yeah, this game is really amazing. Now we got a weapon. I don't even know if I can use it. Um, I don't think I can. We learned how to use it, but we don't have a gun. But uh, I think eventually we will. I don't know. That's why we just kind of went through like a mini tutorial or whatnot. But yeah, man, this game is really awesome. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying the walkthrough here on the channel of Sleeping Dogs. I personally, I'm having a great time. And uh, I just want to thank you again for tuning in, recommending me good games. 
leaving likes comments all that motivates me and lets me know you guys want more so yeah hopefully i'll catch you guys on the next one